everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is April. I make sewing and DIY fashion videos, so make sure to subscribe so you them <laughs> so you never miss out on a new video from me. I took to my Instagram and asked my followers to give me some occasions and events to design for, and you guys came through with some really awesome ideas, but my favorite is this one. First date, but at a cocktail bar in outer space. Shout out to Hannah for this fun idea. I chose the date in outer space because honestly, we could all use an escape from reality. Actually wearing it underneath right now. I just threw this on so I could film this part, but I hope you enjoy seeing what I design and let's get started. This is some fuzzy ombre fabric I've been storing for many years now. It was for my design collection class in college, but I didn't use all of it and it just so happens to be perfect for the space theme. First, I sketched out some designs and was set on doing a super cropped jacket with big balloon sleeves. The rest was harder to figure out, but after more fabric shopping, I decided on a white mini skirt with a beaded mesh overlay and some sort of silver top underneath. To create the jacket pattern, I traced the sleeves and top bodice of a jacket. And after a couple samples, here are my finalized pieces. I slashed and spread the basic sleeve pattern, created a neckband for the jacket, and have the front and back bodice pieces. Now I can cut all of them out. Here are all the pieces to my jacket, including the lining. I don't know if you can notice, but the first sleeve I cut was too short at the bottom and I don't have enough fabric to cut another one. So I just cut a strip of blue and added it to the bottom of the sleeve. To construct the jacket, first sew the shoulder seams together. My steps are kind of all over the place here, but you can go ahead and sew the collar to the neckline at this point if you want to as well, but I forgot to, so I'm facing the two bodice layers together first and sewing the front and back along the bottom of the jacket. Another thing I added was elastic along the bottom of the jacket. It was a last minute decision because after I tried it on, it was kind of loose fitting there. So I just added the elastic so it can hug my body a little more. Today's video is sponsored by Ritual. Ritual is a daily multivitamin that helps fill in the gaps in our diet by providing nutrients that are hard to get like D3 and Omega-3. I love Ritual because I'm someone who never knows exactly what vitamins to take every day. And now I just take two of these. When you open the bottle, it smells so fresh because there's a mint tab inside that you leave in. Ritual is all about transparency. You can see the nutrients inside the capsules so you know exactly what's going in your body. But not only that, they are transparent about where they source their ingredients, the environmental impact of materials used, and their bottles are made from recycled plastic. 
These vitamins are also vegan-free, sugar-free, non-GMO, allergen-free, and gluten-free. I'm taking the essential for women, but they offer men multivitamins, prenatal vitamins for women over 50, and vitamins for teens. With their delivery subscription, you can have your vitamins delivered straight to your door every month, which means it costs a dollar a day to give your body nine high-quality nutrients. If you're interested in trying Ritual out for yourself, you can visit ritual.com slash coolerpa and use my code coolerpa for 10% off your first three months. Now we can sew these sleeves on. To sew the lining and outer sleeve together at the same time, I sandwiched them along the armhole by first pinning the lining layer right sides together to the armhole. and then pinning the outside layer right sides together to the other side of the armhole. Then sew all three layers together along the armhole. You don't have to sew the entire armhole though, just stop where the bottom of the bodice ends up. Next, sew each sleeve layer individually to close up the underarm seam. Now you can go ahead and tuck the lining sleeve inside the outside sleeve. Moving on to the zipper. I really wanted a detachable zipper but couldn't find one at the store. So I'm just using a regular closed bottom zipper I had at home. I definitely need an opening to slide the jacket over my head. So hopefully this little zipper opening will do. The zipper ended up not opening too big, but it's big enough to slide my head through, so that's all that matters. Definitely use a detachable zipper if you can. Lastly, for the jacket, gather the bottom of the sleeves. Then I cut out wristbands that fit the size of my elastic. Sewed it onto the bottom of the sleeves, and we're done with the jacket. I found this awesome pearl embellished mesh fabric and inspired me to make a white mini skirt so the mesh can cover the legs for a transparent look. For the mini skirt, I'm using some stretchy white denim fabric that's super stretchy and comfortable. Cut out one front skirt and two back skirt pieces with a center back seam.
Once the zipper is attached, close up the mesh skirt up to the bottom of the zipper. Lastly, hem the bottom of the mini skirt. Moving on to the bodysuit, I used my Brie Larson bodice pattern and added the bottom half to the pattern. Then I cut out two bodysuits from this stretchy silver fabric. I sewed one bodysuit wrong sides together so it can be white on the inside so it's pretty much reversible. Then go ahead and place one bodysuit inside the other right sides together, sew the entire V-shaped neckline and the entire back up to the neckband, but leave an opening to sew the two ends together later. Turn everything inside out and then sew the ends of the neckband together. Close up the opening by hand sewing or top stitching it down. Lastly, I searched the leg holes and added snaps at the crotch. I kind of rushed this bodysuit because I was in a hurry for my date in outer space, but here's the final look. Alright, that's the end of my video. I had so much fun designing and creating this look. I hope you enjoyed watching and as usual, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye! My day.